Francis Fessmeyer, author of Natural Skyline. I'm going to read to you The Dust Jacket. In the great tradition of Southern literature storytelling, Natural Skyline is an inspirational novel which deals with a pain of loss, one search for self, and the never-ending question, does God exist? It is the 1980s and John Gabriel Rutherford, an emergency physician living in exile on a houseboat, is trapped in the nightmares of the past, whether it be reliving his father's suicide or charging on Yankee breastworks at the Battle of Franklin. Gabe's greatest hope for survival in this world is his true love, Elizabeth Halcyon Morgan, who goes by the nickname Sis. Sis, brilliant, beautiful, and athletic, is an anchor woman for a national news station. Gabe and Sis previously had consummated their love by exchanging vows and silver rings by candlelight, but now, after five years, they are still unmarried. Gabe rationalizes that it must relate to her parents dying when she was young, but deep down, he wonders if something dark and terrifying happened to her in her past, a secret which she is too scared to share even with him. As the story unfolds, we follow Gabe in his vain attempt to escape from his responsibilities to himself, to others, and to God. As his spiritual self spirals downward in an ever-widening gyre, he discovers that he is destined for the same fate as his father. In the dramatic conclusion, we learn that life has meaning, that our world has a caring God, and that life does offer second chances. Nashville Skyline is Francis Fessmeyer's first novel, inspired by Southern writers such as William Faulkner, Robert Penn Warren, Walker Percy, and Pat Conroy. It is written for those who love classic Southern literature that deals with the South's rich Civil War history, the unique qualities of the people, the scars of the past, and the pain of lost love. I exist on imaginary tightrope and must watch every step lest I fall into the cold, dark abyss. I live in constant fear of the future and fear that the inevitable will take place. And I live in constant fear of the past and fear that what has already happened will happen again. How can the present exist in such a world? Gabriel Rutherford, Chapter 1. Bill Dedman, Pulitzer Prize winner, investigative reporter from MSNBC said, Nashville Skyline is a moving story of human weakness and redemption. Fueled by Southern history and classical mythology, Fessmeyer's story of Gabe Rutherford's journey will stir anyone who remembers the sting of a lost loved one or the heartbreak of lost love. Lisa Bauer, in her five out of five star forward Clarion Review states, in a book that spans the past, present, and future, and dips his toe into dream, faith, and the other world, Gabe and Sis struggle to do right in a world that has failed them will resonate with readers of all ages and backgrounds. Fessmeyer is able to zero in on faith and Gabe's reawakening to God and life with grace. Pulitzer Prize winner Robert Coles, an author of Walker Percy, an American search in Flannery O'Connor in South, said, The glorious son of another Southern physician writer, our beloved Dr. Percy, has wonderfully warmed Francis Fessmeyer. Phil Cole, academic dean of Richmond Graduate University, said, C.S. Lewis once said, God whispers in our pleasure, but shouts in our pain. In Nashville Skyline, Francis Fessmeyer articulates a powerful, personal message of pain and love, and we should all listen. Thank you.